After a year in an Italian prison, American Amanda Knox appeared in court Friday at the opening of her murder trial. Knox and her Italian former boyfriend, Raffaele Solecito, are standing trial on charges of murder and sexual assault of Amanda's roommate, British student Meredith Kercher. Amanda, wearing a gray hooded sweatshirt and striped top, seemed relaxed and even smiled as she entered into the packed courtroom to face the judge and eight-member jury. In contrast, Solecito, wearing a green sweater, looked thin and drawn and appeared tense, despite comments by his lawyer that he is not afraid because he knows he is innocent. Solecito's lawyer, Giulia Buongiorno. Raffaele, no, no. Raffaele is absolutely unafraid of what might happen here at this trial because he knows he is innocent. The two sat beside their lawyers as police stood nearby. Knox and Solecito are accused of sexually assaulting and slitting the throat of British exchange student Meredith Kircher in November 2007. Prosecutors say it is a case of a sex game in which Solecito held Meredith down by the shoulders. Amanda held a knife to her neck while Rudy Guede of the Ivory Coast sexually assaulted her. Guede was convicted in October and sentenced to 30 years in prison. Both Knox and Solecito insist they are innocent, although they have given conflicting accounts of what happened on the night of the murder. Italy does not have a death penalty, and convictions would bring a maximum sentence of life imprisonment. Over 100 witnesses have been called to testify in this trial, and lawyers say it could last up to a year. Tricia Thomas, Associated Press, Perugia.